Whoa, cool. Look at that parkour there. I need an address for a property developer. Elysian Fields Developments. One moment, detective. The address is 748 North Oxford Avenue, Wilshire. Anything else? Messages, please. Messages? What for? You have a message. Contact Captain McKelty immediately. Thanks. Can you put me through, operator? Of course. Here you are. Oh, thanks. Commander? Leads on the Morelli farm. We're about to go and visit Elysian Fields Developments. You're about to do what? Leland Monroe? He's a personal friend of the mayor and the chief. Are you out of your mind? I'm warning you, Phelps. Commander, we have a line of inquiry. You have something, you bring it to me. You're hanging by a thread, Phelps. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Good. Have a report on my desk today. What a dick. Kelty has warned us off over a lesion. Makes sense. It's at that end. We should check out Rancho Escondido. You know the place? Sure. On our fountain in Wilton. Let's go. Oh my god. They're covering up for somebody again. What's up with this? Oh my god, this isn't our car. <laughs> just went <laughs> just went in the fucking coroner's car. Come on, get in. Got anything else to say, Herschel? Oh shit. Take it easy, Phelps. I'd rather get there in one piece. <laughs> I'm surprised he has nothing to say after that all the stuff we just found out. Oh, I think we're about to get a street crime. Heard the radio waggling. Oh shit. I was kinda attached to the paint shop, Cole. <laughs> Sorry, Herschel. I'm a bit of a maniac on the road. Oh boy, your supermarket. We don't hear like Oh, for Earlier. God's sakes. I remember seeing that. Left and left and left and left again and I'm right up your ass. <laughs> right, how far now? Um, okay, right and then right round, okay. Right up ahead. Thanks, Hirsch. Right, so this is getting weird again. They're wanting to cover up just because a guy's a friend of the mayor or something. A friend of the chief. So we're not allowed to investigate. What's, what's that shit out of Whoa! <laughs> you know, there are times when you really miss a nightstick. There's more religion in the end of a nightstick than in a hundred cathedrals. Oh. Whoa. This place is on fire too. I'm not gonna tell you again, sir. Don't tell me when and how I can come and go on my own property. It is not This is safe, America, sir. dickhead. Now step back oh. or I'll lock you up for Smart a while. Smart son of a bitch. Oh my god. Oh my god, they're all gonna... Hey, already. Lacking. That's oh. done it, Cole. We're gonna have to pacify these close saps. Pacify? I'm gonna bust you come on, then. Out. Are you now? I don't think you are, son. Well, actually, you've been more like my granddad. Finish. Oh my god, what is that? Oh my god, that was a glitch. Glitch and a half there. Get your asses in there. Where's the Good old thing guy? You showed up when you did, detectives. Those folks were baying for blood. Oh, thanks. Okay, then. Let's see if there's anything left to take a look at. Ah, oh, come on. I'm stumped. Ideas? I hate this. I don't like wow. arson. There's not much left, but it's worth a shot. What's he picking up here? Whoa. Okay. Press. Oh, press A. Okay. Oh. Mortar is like dust. Is that normal in a fire? You'd expect some shrinkage in the heat, but it looks like the cement barely adhered to the brick. Oh. Doesn't appear to be any wall ties either. This thing looks like it was built on the cheap. Oh. Whoa. 
Okay. If we're paying a visit to Alician and ruining my career, let's bite the bullet and get on with it. Well, that's it. That's all we got to check. Oh, God, that's great. I thought we were going to have to check all the fucking houses. Come on, then. Uh, Herschel. See you later. Right. So I guess we do have to go to Elysian now. I hate this jog that you have to do when you're in a... Like a zone. You can only jog. What's that music about? Are you about to get chased? Or something? I don't understand the music. Whoa! What was that about? That little glitch there? Whoa! Nice. Come on, Harshaw, you must have something to say. We'll know what we've been if we try to retrace our steps. <laughs> True. <clears throat> oh, look at this. Uh, making a ton of houses, that's for sure. Well, here we are, just up here, is it? Oh, God. You like to leave your mark, don't you? Yeah, I like to know where, where I've been. You're not helping. <laughs> the bonnet flew off there. Oh man, the captain is going to be mad at us. He's going to rip what us a new one. Careful with Monroe, fellas. He's got a lot of clout and he's pretty sharp. Clout? Hmm, not really sure what clout is. Sorry. Detectives Phelps and Biggs, LAPD, to see Leland Monroe. Do you have an appointment? With a police lady. We don't need an appointment. Can I tell him what it's about? It's an official investigation. There are two police officers here to see Mr. Monroe. Send them through. Wait. So there's a receptionist and that's there. that's our cue. Thanks, ma'am. There's a receptionist there. Then there's another one. Okay. Can I help you, gentlemen? If we're not here to see you. I would like to speak to Mr. Monroe. I'm afraid it's impossible. Mr. Monroe's schedule is booked weeks in advance. Cut to the chase, sister. Is he in? I'm not at liberty to reveal that officer. So he hired you for your intelligence? <laughs> I find that offensive. You have every right to. This is getting us nowhere, miss. Casino. Stupid Would you man. like us to return with a warrant? That won't be necessary, gentlemen. Come into my office. Hmm. So this is a stupid guy on the posters. You like a cigar? Oh my god, look at this place. Boy. Sure, I'll have a scotch. Biggs! You are no Royston. You do not talk like that. Ooh. Oh, that's actually rather cheap. Compared to nowadays. <laughs> okay. I guess we check all these places then. Mm -hmm. Pretty fancy. Check this one. No? We're investigating Damn a series it. of domestic fires, Mr. Monroe. Terrible boys. How can I help? Hmm. Elysian Fields and Suburban Redevelopment Fund flyers keep turning up in the vicinity of the fires. They're turning up all over town, boys. Can you imagine the current demand for housing? So that's your explanation, Mr. Monroe? Coincidence? Explanation? Why, what's to explain? I advertise on radio and billboards for buyers, and I advertise for sellers using Weber. Can't even see his eyeballs. Truth? What's your connection to the suburban redevelopment? Shit. An organization of civic-minded individuals whose 
goal is to make the city a better place for its inhabitants. Something I was proud to be asked to join. Okay, here's just contest thing. What do you know about a competition for families to win free vacations to Catalina Island? My company runs many promotions. I'm, I'm not familiar with that one. Really? Well, that is spooker up. Uh, <laughs> it's right there. Okay. So you like to lie, do you? Level with me, Mr. Monroe. You know all about the vacation offers. You can believe whatever you like, son. You're missing the vital ingredient called proof. Oh, really? Man, these guys should like to lie. Your face is all over the flyers, Mr. Monroe. You know about the prizes, and you're aware that they get given to holdouts. My face is the brand. It's on all our advertising. Did you know that the mayor and the chief of police are part of the Suburban Redevelopment Fund? Who gives a shit? Do you want to accuse them of murder as well? Yes, I do. Oh, what's this? Hoxter. Oh, sweet. Okay. Look at that stupid face. How the hell can that guy even see? We've made offers to buy houses in areas where fires have been recorded. <laughs> Are you suggesting that I'm burning people out of their homes so that I can sell them new ones? What happens to your plans if a family like the Morellis refuses to sell? We work around them. Business finds a way. That's the American way. Hmm. Again, I don't think we have anything. Uh, doubt, maybe? Come on, yes. You expect me to believe that you would build a new development with one of those old piles smack bang in the center of it? Progress is an inexorable process, detective. Those who choose to stand in defiance are usually confined to the waste basket of history. Okay. To answer your question, yes, we would build around them if we had to. Most people see sense. All right. Let's do this Rancho one, then. What's Elysian Field's involvement in Rancho Escondido? One of our latest housing developments. It was due to open on the weekend, or was before the unfortunate conflagration. It met with building code regulation. Absolutely. Only the best for our returning heroes. Really? God, this guy is one hell of a bad liar. liar bro. There's something out of kilter about that development. Son, I've had enough of you and your fidgety friend. There's no way in hell you can prove that my materials were inferior. Oh, my God. Poor cement quality. I'm no expert. But I think we'll find that the bricks being used on those houses are undersized and the mortar is faulty. And there's no wall ties connecting the masonry to the frame. Every building is built to a budget, boys. Those buildings were inspected and fully insured by California Fire and Light. Investment of that magnitude demands it. Do you think they'd vouch for the buildings without examining them? The arsonists. Do you have any suspects? We aren't at liberty to say. I didn't think so. The contractors I use for waybills. Do you suppose there could be any of them? I have a list of their names, if it'd be of any help. That would be very helpful, oh, Mr. Monroe. Cool. Glad to hear it. I'm always happy to help the LAPD. My secretary will provide you with that list. Did you know that I'm on the board of the Pension fund. Is that a threat to Herschel? Herschel will kick your ass. 